Terror group Hamas has appointed Yahya Shinwar, Israel's most wanted man, and also referred to as Dead Man Walking, as its chief in the middle of a full-blown war, which has now entered in its 11th month. Will Israel hunt down Yahya Shinwar? News 9 Plus decodes. Israel's army chief has sworn to locate and eliminate Yahya Shinwar, much like what happened after the October 7 attacks, which left over 1,100 people dead. In retaliation, Israel said it would destroy Hamas. Why is Israel looking for Yahya Shinwar? Shinwar is accused of masterminding Hamas's October 7 attacks, the worst in Israel's history. At least 250 people were taken hostage by Hamas, some of whom have been killed, some released, while others still languish in captivity. Although the Israeli military has insisted that Shinwar was a dead man walking in the aftermath of the October 7 attacks, he has not been seen since. Why was Shinwar appointed Hamas chief? Shinwar's predecessor, Ismail Hania, was assassinated in Tehran last week. Iran and Hamas blame Israel for the assassination. Shinwar's appointment coincides with Israel's preparations for potential retaliation from Iran, Hamas and Hezbollah in Lebanon. What does Shinwar's appointment mean? Israel says his appointment sends a clear message about Hamas's unwavering commitment to resistance. Experts say that Shinwar is more hesitant to agree to a Gaza ceasefire and has closer ties to Tehran, compared to his predecessor, Ismail Haniya. With Shinwar as Hamas chief, chances of a ceasefire agreement are slimmer than before. Hamas is also likely to further embolden its hardline military strategy under Shinwar's leadership. US Secretary of State Anthony Blinken said Shinwar has been and remains the primary decider of a ceasefire agreement between Israel and Hamas. Described as radical and pragmatic by other Hamas leaders and members, Shinwar's appointment as chief not only bodes poorly for Israeli hostages, but also threatens to further intensify the already escalating regional tensions in the Middle West.